everyone welcome back to DIY Geek YouTube channel in this video I am going to show you how to set up an Alexa Echo Dot and uh, first thing that you want to do is make sure that you have the Alexa app and your account set up so that you will be ready to add this device um, this is a pre-configured device but I'm going to show you what to do uh, both ways whether this is a brand new echo dot out of the box or is an existing device how to reset it up the the step is about the about the same all right so let's get started uh, first thing like I said um, what you want to do is make sure that you can get into an Alexa app so just get into the Alexa app right here okay once you are in the Alexa app you click on devices or device yeah devices at the bottom and then the, you go to the top right and you would want to tap on the plus sign to add device all right and then here um, you are going to choose the type of device which is Amazon Echo and then you would want to choose this one uh, the Echo Echo Dot Echo Plus etc before I do that, I'm going to go ahead and um, go to the other part, which is setting up the actual physical device itself and show you how to, um, to set this one up. Okay, so on the physical device itself, what you want to do is first plug it in, obviously. If this is your first time plugging in a brand new device, uh, it'll take about 15 seconds for it to boot up either way, brand new or used and for a brand new one it will automatically go to the setup mode which is basically an orange light around this light device thing called the ring light it will show orange which means that you're in setup mode and then you're ready to press the next step uh, from that screen there um, if you are not if this is not a brand new device you would have to press this action button right here this this uh, round dot right here Press it for about 15 seconds so that um, you can enter setup mode. All right, so my device is not brand new. I've done this uh, for practice for this video. So I'm going to press this button right here for 15 seconds. All right, so here we go. Pressing it right now. And uh, once it enters setup mode, I'm going to... Now in setup mode, follow the instructions in your Alexa app. Okay, so it is uh, in setup mode. I'm going to tap next on the uh, app. And as you can see, there is looking for this orange ring light. And I'm going to click yes. I'm, I do see it. It detects the uh, echo dot. And I'm going to go ahead and click or tap connect. And uh, right now it's searching for my Wi-Fi. Now, I'm already um, set up with my Wi-Fi. If you are not set up, this is your first time with the Alexa app and the Echo Dot or connecting any device, you may be asked to set up your Wi-Fi at this time. Uh, but if you your already have, ready. if you already have other devices already set up in your uh, Alexa app, it already knows your Wi-Fi setting, it will just use it. If you want it to um, change it to a different Wi-Fi or you have two Wi-Fi networks in your house, you can click here to tap to change it, etc. Um, keep in mind that, um, the Amazon app is smart enough, even if you have it on two different Wi-Fi's, it can still connect through the Amazon cloud so that you can still access this device from one um, Alexa app. So you can have many different devices mm -hmm. and in, in many different networks, even many different locations all manage in the same app, which is very cool. All right, so I'm going to click continue. The next couple of steps are optional. Here's the, to choose a language. Here's the um, to choose a location. You can skip this. Um, I prefer to just go ahead and at least um, add a location. And then the, um, this is for uh, giving a precise or more precise location of your Echo Dot by providing an address. I'm going to go ahead and skip right now and click continue. Amazon Sidewalk um, is something to um, help in a kind of neighborhood um, to, to do tracking, etc. Um, kind of like an Apple AirPod. I don't really want it enabled, so I'm going to go ahead and disable that. 
and then that's it. Your setup is done, um, and you can do anything that you want right now that Alexa would uh, allow. I'm gonna create another video also in regards to restricting Amazon Alexa for the purpose of being conservative and, and securing so that um, you will less likely be hacked or um, possibility of being listened upon, etc., which is uh, a lot of paranoia um, for the Amazon Alexa or any listening devices, whether it's the Google or um, the Apple Siri, etc., all these devices. Anyways, um, thank you for watching this video. Uh, hope you find it useful. If you have um, any suggestion, comments, um, better ways of doing any of these things, please put it in the comment. Um, otherwise, would appreciate if you give it a thumbs up so other YouTube uh, watchers can discover this video. And please subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel to see more do-it-yourself videos like these and support my channel. Thank you.